Hi everyone, welcome back from Labor Day weekend. Hope you guys had a little bit of a break, maybe some time to spend with other people, I don't know. Um, you know, it's a tough time. I hope you guys had a little bit of a chance to get your head out of things and uh, just recalibrate because we're moving forward and we have all of the rest of the semester together to enjoy. So today's week is actually, uh, sorry, the week that starts today is actually a lot of fun. Um, we're going to see new data types. We're going to start working with text data. Uh, we're going to see our first example of Java objects, which is something that is a topic that's going to consume us for the middle third of this class. And we'll also talk about a little bit of Java history and the, the nothing that is in Java or the null value and how to avoid making mistakes with it later in the week. So that's the week. Today's lesson is a little bit of a grab bag, a chance to um, you know, clean up some of the stuff that we missed last week and sort of get your head back in the game for, for the fun that we have ahead this week. So one important reminder, starting today, the daily lessons are daily lessons. They are due on the day that they are assigned. We do not give extensions for the homework problems. We never have, uh, and we, we won't going forward. Uh, we have a generous drop policy for the homework problems and every other component of your CS125 grade. Those drops are there to account for all of the things that you might want an extension because, whether that's forgetfulness, or I fell asleep, or I just didn't get to it, or I was having a really bad day, or I decided to go for a walk instead, or something happened in my personal life, or whatever. Um, the, you know, the, the drop policy is also designed to express, from our perspective, kind of the minimum amount of work that you can miss in a semester and still get what you need to get out of this class. So, you know, sometimes people have some really traumatic life event that goes on during the semester, and sometimes at that point you just really need to put your classes aside in order to handle that. Because, you know, if um, you know, we make accommodations for you in CS 125, you're just going to struggle down the road. So anyway, those drops, again, are there to use as you want. I wouldn't, you know, use them up all at the beginning of the semester. I really wouldn't use them in general. They're really designed to handle the type of things that come up in your life without meaning to that just might mean that from time to time, you're just not going to get one of the daily homework problems done. That's cool. Um, you know, make sure you try to get them done the next day. They're always up there to practice. Um, but, you know, daily consistent practice is a huge part of how students succeed in this class. And so that's something that we really do support. Um, you guys aren't alone. Uh, we're all in this together for the rest of the semester. We have a fantastic staff. It's really fun to see some of the assistants coming online to help out with office hours and the help site. Um, we're there for you on the forum. You know, we have lots of different ways to connect with the staff. If you have trouble, um, there are a lot of times where you can reach out and, and we'll be there for you. So. I hope you make sure that you know you remember that you're not alone. Take good care of the people around you. Uh, welcome back to CS125. I hope you enjoyed today's lesson.